Our starting point at this hour, the Independent Council probe into the corruption scandal that's gripping the nation. The team broadened its investigation to include a request for information about the assets of Chesun Shil and her associates. Plus, the National Pension Service chief is, pro is placed under emergency detention and more people believed to be involved in compiling a presidential office cultural blacklist are summoned. Hwang Ojun has our top story. During a briefing on Wednesday afternoon, the Independent Council team spokesperson Yi Gu Chol said they've asked the Financial Supervisory Service to hand over information on the personal assets of Choi Sun Shil, the jail confidant of President Park, and 40 of her associates. Lee said the team cannot disclose the selection criteria used for the 40 people. Lee also said the council will summon Korean ambassador to France Mo Chol Min for questioning when he returns to Korea on Wednesday evening. Mo is suspected of involvement in connection to allegations that the Park administration compiled a blacklist of artists and cultural figures critical of the president and then sent it to the culture ministry. Mo was serving as a presidential senior secretary for education and culture in 2014 when it suspected the list was compiled. The council is also questioning Kim sang ryul President Park's former senior secretary for education and culture, on the same matter. Kim is the uncle of Chaun Tech, a former music video director and a friend of Choi Sun Shil. Earlier on Wednesday, the team detained Moon Hyung Pyo, who was a chief of the National Pension Service, on suspicions he pressured the NPS to greenlight a controversial merger between Samsung CNT and Tail Industries. NPS is the main shareholder of Samsung CNT. The merger was completed last year during Moon's term as Korea's health minister. Moon has denied the charge. The council now has 48 hours to seek an arrest warrant for Moon or let him go. The team is also seeking evidence that could shed light on President Park's whereabouts during the Seoul Ho Ferry disaster. They raided the home and office of Dr. Kim Young-jae, who ran a clinic that allegedly provided regular medical services to President Park in the presidential office. Kim is not registered as an official medical consultant to the president, but it's suspected he was granted special access to the presidential office through his personal connection with Choi Sun-sil. Hwang Wo-jun, Arirang News.